I'm Sarah Bridge with King's News News, and here's your top headlines today, October 20th, 2023. Kingston Health Sciences Centre has been recognized by Ontario Health's Trillium Gift of Life Network for its outstanding efforts to integrate organ and tissue donation into quality end-of-life care. According to a release from the Centre, the hospital agency is among only seven hospitals in the province to receive the Award of Excellence for successfully converting potential organ donors into actual donors at a minimum of 63% of the time. Right now and in the coming months, many community members will rely on donated coats to help keep them warm, according to the United Way KFLNA. As such, the local United Way is encouraging those in the community to help out once again as they kick off their fourth annual coat drive. These items can be new or gently used. The only requirement is that they are washable and in good condition. Donations for the coats for Community Drive can be dropped off in collection bins from Monday, October 23rd to Monday, November 13th, 2023. At its regular meeting on Tuesday, October 17, 2023, Kingston City Council voted to approve a 12-month blanket municipal support resolution for long-term projects recommended by the Independent Energy System Operator. City staff recommended that Council provide a 12-month blanket municipal support resolution for long-term reliability projects in the form prescribed by the Independent Electricity System Operator, the sole purpose of which is to facilitate applications made for long-term reliability. In order to prevent delays and ensure the project could commence in 2024, Kingston City Council has approved a $3.7 million budget request for the Hanson Memorial Parking Garage Restoration Project. The proposal came before Council at its meeting on Tuesday, October 17, 2023, by way of a request for advanced budget approval, as the 2024 budget deliberations have yet to begin. Kingston City Council has approved the implementation of deferred 2023 charges for bulk water usage and wastewater septage disposal. The vote comes after Council approved the new charges back in March, but elected at an April meeting to defer the implementation of those charges. Starting in January of 2024, customers who purchase water in bulk from Utilities Kingston will be charged $3.73 per cubic meter, up from the $2.27 they pay now. For more on these stories and other local news, please visit kingstonist.com and subscribe.